Anna, thanks very much. And breaking news now, a car crashed into a light pole on Milwaukee's east side, but it's what happened before the crash that has police officers investigating a fatal shooting. Johnny Kaplan has been following these breaking details through the morning and joins us live from Bartlett and North this morning. Hi, Jonah. Vince, there's a lot to keep track, but this is what we know from Milwaukee police this morning. Four victims, three shootings in three locations, one person shot dead. It started about a mile away from here at 6th and Meineke, and then it ended here at Bartlett and North. We're just a block west of Oakland. You can take a look. You see two cones here. Let's start with the one on the right. That was where a light pole once stood. There's a plastic bag covering the live wires now, which were uh, disconnected by We Energies. The one to the left, this was the utility pole, snapped in half like a twig by the car crash. And you take a look at the video from earlier this morning. This was at about 3.30. This was where the car crashed. You could see it slamming right into that pole. And police say that this crash and everything started at about 12.15 last night at 6th and Meineke, like I mentioned before, about a mile away from here. Police say that there was a shooting there and then a second one about a couple blocks west of there at 8th and Meineke. And then someone, some person involved in that shooting got in the car and then drove here before crashing into that pole. A few people taken to the hospital. We, of course, will be checking in on them later today. And we are live here on the city's east side. Jonah Camp on today's TMJ4. All right, Jonah, thank you very much. It is six